Okay, we're in uh, the Oahis. We're at a site called Nickel Creek. And the landowner here again, the private landowner, agreed to do a cooperative project to benefit sage grouse and his range. And the response, this is the second growing season afterwards, this response after the treatment, taking out over 200 acres of juniper, has been tremendous. Both right close to where we took the tree out. We're literally by the stumps of the trees. And Idaho fescue has popped through, one of our best grasses. Uh, Blue bunch wheat grasses pop through. The sage actually gets more robust and healthier as well. So the sage plant, bitter brush right here behind me. Uh, this is an elderberry plant, and then, so it's taking off, and it's really important for deer and elk as well. Uh, arrow leaf balsam root and uh, lupin. So, I mean, the, all the native stuff is definitely taking off and responding really well. The nice thing we find about juniper treatment too is it's very specific. It takes out only the problem juniper situation and uh, doesn't introduce any kind of weed, doesn't introduce the risk that we have with fire. And so with juniper mastication, we can be very specific about our treatment and get a quick response the year after and for sure two and three years later you just got a tremendous response and good vegetation. The native vegetation that the sage grouse really, really have to have for their broods and for reproduction.